Hey everybody, welcome back again to Ken Tamplin Vocal Academy where the proof is in the singing. I got quite a few requests for this one and it's Roy Orbison. Um, we do this by request or I do this by request and uh, I want you guys to know I try to get to as many requests as I can and it depends a lot on you know the view count of course but also if you can find good videos and YouTube has been cracking down quite a bit on everybody about what videos you can or can't use so I have to kind of comb and find something that looks like it might be worthy or at least a song I know that's worthy. Now I would have loved to have done Pretty Woman or maybe some of his more popular songs. Crying is still a very popular song but uh, hopefully I haven't seen this yet but it'll uh, be exemplary of his his voice and his talent. So without much further ado, let's just dive right in. I was alright for a while. I could smile for a while. All right. Now, we, I don't know when I'm going to release these videos, but I did a video of Dismash, Dimash, uh, doing Hello by Lionel Richie. And then I also did Luther Vandross. Um, and we talked a lot about mixed voice, especially in the Luther video. He is doing the same thing, you know. I was alright. I, I could smile for a little while. Right? He's using a very, very sensitive tone, adding some warmth and bringing kind of a head chest mix in it. Mostly chest, a real soft, uh, you know, brought up chest sound with a lot of air. But he's not real shrill or real belty on the sound at all. He's real warm and he has a lot of, you know, Caprino vibrato. He has a lot of goat's wiggle vibrato, but that's his thing. But he kind of approaches it more like a crooner, you know what I mean? Like, um, you know, old school, uh, everything from Frank Sinatra, Harry Connick Jr., you know, that approach. So, uh, if anything, he'd be the first to do it and they, Harry Connick Jr. came along after the fact. Not Sinatra, but Harry Connick and others, you know, Buble, etc. But uh, so, with that said, let's take a, a listen with a view towards that. Here we go. But I, saw you last night, you held my hand so I love that change. So, 50s. Or 60s. You me well, you couldn't tell. So if you notice, like I said, it's kind of like a late 60s, 50s, uh, let's say late 60s, late 50s, early 60s, mid 60s kind of sound. It's very unassuming, but what's cool about it, you know, kind of like the Beach Boys and others who, who also were a little unassuming in some of the way they approach their music, is it's not real in your face. So it actually makes you kind of strained to want to listen to it. Um, and that actually kind of draws you into his sound. You know what I mean? So it's like Jack Johnson is like that. And there's other Sade, you know, where they're not, you know, you know, just belting at you. They, they kind of are real winsome in the way they present their art and draw you in to have you listen to um, their story. So it's cool. On and crying, 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 crying. It's hard Good songwriting, man. Understand, but the touch of your hand and start me crying, crying. I thought that I was over you. So let's do this together for my singer friends. Instead of, I thought that I, instead of belting into the sound, I want you to do this real gentle. I thought that I, right? I, I'm actually in head voice. I'm bringing just a little bit of chest into the sound and I'm adding some air. So I thought that I, instead of I thought that I, now I can add more mix to I thought that I, right? I can add a little bit more resonance into that sound and make it louder or bigger or bolder, more bold. Um, but in this case, like I said, he's real sweet on it, real gentle. Now you can take that sound if you guys want to grow your passaggio. I, 
And you can do some sirens to sort of force that throat or you know um, stretch and train that throat to stay open so that you can bring your head voice down in through the passaggio, in through your mixed voice area and chest and get a percentage of that mixed voice without hearing the register break or without hearing the yodel or what I call the speed bump, okay? So I just wanted to clarify that because you can really hear it. Let me, let me back this up again and listen to the exchange as he goes from chest to head on the word I, okay? Here we go. I thought that I was over you, but it's true. And now it's more chest. So true. I love you even more chest. Than I did before. Still more chest. But darling, what See? Can but darling. He's adding a lot of air to that sound as he's coming back down. He's kind of mixing it to give you a mixed voice for a real nice, sweet, gentle sound. It's more chest. It's a chest mix, but more chest. You know, he's got more, more chest in the sound, that's cool. <laughs> if you look closely at that guitar player, let me back this up real close. Kind of looks like Bruce Springsteen a little bit, check it out. Does it look like Bruce? A little bit. I think so. Try that. Right? So that's pure head voice, it's nice. You know, Roy, man, he's been around a long time. I forget how old he is, but he's he's way up there in his years and he's still killing it, man. That's awesome. You know, I saw Frankie Valley not that long ago either uh, doing the Jersey Boy, Boy Tour and he was also killing it. And he's like way up there in his years also. I grew up on that stuff, roller skating to some of his music when I was like five years old. And he was kind of, you know, he was a, well, probably in his teens or late tw early 20s back then. So anyway, guys, if you like what you heard, please like and subscribe to my channel. That would be super awesome. I have a singing course. It's called How to Sing better than anyone else and we negotiate and discuss all of these different techniques and styles and types and whatnot how you too can achieve and uh, go after your singing music goals all right and until next time god bless peace out hey guys if you like what you heard please like and subscribe to my channel by clicking on the subscribe button that will actually take you to another page where you want to click on the bell icon and it opens up a menu and the menu has notifications on it where there's a little box you can check where it says send me all notifications for this channel. Check the box and then click the save button and you'll get notifications from me every time I have a cool video come out. Okay? Thanks guys. Peace. Out.